Well, hey everyone, and welcome to our physics homework tutorial. Uh, we hope you find this tutorial helpful in your study of physics, and if you do, please visit our website at www.physicsvodcast.com. There you're going to find over 200 physics examples in every topic of physics. Uh, it's sure to help you get through that physics homework. We'll see you then! Okay, we're uh, looking at liquid pressure here in this problem, and I'm uh, going to tie this into a, a classic uh, novel, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea, and uh, we're going to figure out how much water pressure did the Nautilus have to withstand um, when it was 2,000 meters under the surface. So, figure out pressure, we have to take... Um, our pressure equation, which will tell us that um, if we take the density of the water that it's in, multiply it by force of gravity and how deep it is, that that will simply give us pressure that the Nautilus is undergoing. So pressure is equal to uh, the density of the water is given to us at 1,025, and that's kilogram per meter cubed, okay, force of gravity 9.8 meters per second squared, and the distance it's under the water is 2,000 meters. Please note that our units are all matching up, in other words, we're using kilograms, meters, and seconds in this. Multiply that out, and you'll get something in the order of magnitude 2 times 10 to the 7 pascals. Okay, so now we have our pressure value given. Uh, the second part of this says calculate the force exerted on a 0.85 square meter porthole. And again, remember that pressure can also be defined as a ratio of force per area. So we have a pressure value that has been calculated at 2 times 10 to the 7th pascals. We are looking for the force value they've given us an area. And so through some simple algebra then, we can find that the force that would need to be withstood by this porthole here is actually 1.7 times 10 to the seventh newtons. So that would be the force exerted by the water. Thank <laughs> you.